the first quarterback of a professional football team in Seattle. Now he's the head coach of the newest football team in Seattle as the hometown Dragons open up in front of what is expected to be 30,000 fans hosting the Tampa Bay Vipers here in week two of the XFL on Fox. 6'2", 200 pounds on the outside. Game seven. Cornelius under center this time. Off the play fake all kinds of time. Throws. Hit as he throws, and that causes the interception. Jeremy Clark with the pick. First turnover of the ball game for either squad. This hometown Seattle team going crazy. Huge mistake for Cornelius here. They're trying to get a big over route run and trying to get the ball to Nick Truesdale, the tight end. Cornelius got caught up, and then at the last se second, he panicked. Right here, they're trying to get a, cl a clear out, and then they're trying to get the tight end all the way back here. Watch as this over route, and he, right when he gets hit, he just kind of throws it in between them. That ball either has to go over to the sideline or the 30. Here comes the pressure. Flowers caught in the backfield at set. Niles Morgan along with Steve Williams, and it'll be a turnover on down. Yeah, and a huge mistake there from Flowers. When you're on a fourth down, that ball has got to come out of your hand. The worst thing that you can possibly do there is take a sack. Even if you throw a pick, you're gaining the yardage of the pick. You can't take a sack at that point. He's got to throw that ball away, even though it's on the fourth down, and there for Seattle, their protection. Here's Silvers on third down. Caught Reynolds. Moves the change down to the 20 yard line. They needed 11. They got 13. Nice play there from Silvers. Good timing. Reynolds, great route, found an opening, and then Silvers is able to put it on his frame for an easy first down. Reynolds is showing. The hold is good. The kick is wide left. Put some time with the Miami Dolphins. Here comes the blitz. Caught. Reese Horn into Dragon territory. Biggest pass play of the day for the Vipers so far, 17 yards. Yeah, nice little, it's either a little play action or an RPO here, but Cornelius, he's got that little route right behind the linebackers. I love what Reese Horn does. Do you see him just settle down? He didn't run through that zone. He settled down. Gave... Off the play fake. Nick Truesdale, the tight end, runs it to his own man, keeps going, gets the first and more. All the way down to the 15-yard line. I don't know if you call that second effort if you hit your own guy, but whatever it is, <laughs> right. it worked. Uh, this one from 36 yards away. It's true. First points of the ball game with two minutes, 33 seconds to go in the first half. And his name was the one that kept coming up. They on third down. Silvers going deep. Got a man, Reynolds, they can't connect. Robert Priester on the coverage. Third quarter. Paul. This is John Santiago now in on the kick return. A big return for Seattle out near midfield. Hands it off. Trey Williams cuts it back. Running room. Good blocking downfield. And he stays on his feet all the way to the 35-yard line. Go, bingo. Go. <laughs> that one picked off. He threw it behind Hamlet. And right into the arm. Of Tavares McFadden, who's down the sideline with an escort and into the end zone for the touchdown. 78 yards on the pick six. It almost looked like this one was tipped at the line of scrimmage. Corey Moore, number 31, was racing in on a pressure. Watch here. Here's Corey Moore. He's coming on that right side of the offense, number 31. He jumps up, and it looks like that ball fluttered and then winds up in the hands of Tavarius.
McFadden who takes it the distance. One point conversion from the two yard line. What a play from McFadden and astutely gets up. No one touched him down the sideline. Here's Silvers to pass. Over the middle, he's got a man wide open. Keenan Reynolds, and that's the way to answer. All the way to the house. The answer is 78 yard pick six with a 68 yard touchdown pass. This aggressive defense got caught. Jerry Glanville talks about the safety cutting routes, jumping routes. This is what happens. Watch as the safety's going to come up, and that's what allows Reynolds as the safety comes up right there. Silver sees him, and now Reynolds is going to be behind him deep, and he lays it out in front of him. Reynolds runs underneath it, and there's the fireworks that the faithful have wanted. Silvers finally gets it going. Reynolds finds the end zone, and the Dragons have some life. From the five yard line. Under pressure. Farrell. Nowhere to go. Starting deep in their own territory. He hands it off on first down. Debian Smith just keeps fighting through. They fit the pitch. Flowers. Wide open is Dan Williams with good hands from Jeremy Clark. That's kind of short. He threw it low and I just jumped up and got it. How quickly do you see that play happening before your eyes? I seen it and he was just dropping right into me. And he threw it low and I just jumped up. You know, defensive pick six for their touchdown. And that may be over as Jacquez Patrick keeps on fighting. He's going to be stopped just short of the. So they'll try and get a little closer. Andrew Franks. The former Miami Dolphin kicker, high snap, bobble. Nowhere to go, they get no points. It's such an important part of the play in the position, and he missed it there. High punt. Another good job. Field and move the chains. Across the 25. Again, Patrick with a big hole that time. Running room after, and he's out near midfield. A slot to the top. Cornelius can't get rid of it as he is brought down for the sack. Jordan Thompson, number 99, ends that drive. Look as all the defensive players are stood up, and then at the last moment, Thompson, he's going to hit the center, and then the center disengages. Jordan McRae there makes a mistake. He's got to stay on that block. Cornelius gets the pressure right in his face. He's got no chance. Thompson is there to get the sack, and this Seattle Dragons defense with Clayton Lopez has played just a tremendous game. Yeah, that's their fourth sack of the game. They've also got an interception for the scores. Kenneth Farrow takes it on first down. Drifting just inside the upright. And the lead is now eight. Most of the time right there. Cornelius caught in the middle of the field. Andre DeAndre Goolsby. Starts again. 11 yards, and then you see it only cost him two seconds because of the clock stoppage. Demian Smith out of the backfield, another first down. Cornelius towards the end zone. Flags fly. Williams caught it. Touchdown, Tampa. Unless it's an offensive penalty. 
It looked like Williams pushed off there in order to get That's the room. Offense number 81. Ten-yard penalty from the previous spot. We play first down. This is the ball game. Cornelius. Towards the end zone. Intercepted. Game over. Kyle Carroll finishes it off.